Hi folks, this is Jay. Hope you're okay today. It's good to be with you. We're looking at uh, the Word of God and um, the Word of God in your life. And I just want to talk about apostasy. In the last days, there's going to be more delusion, more blindness. People are just going to follow false prophets, false religions, false, false arguments, false evidence. And we need to be teaching the word of God to people but also we if we're going to be discerning know who are the cults like the Mormons and witnesses of cults know whether Islam is true or not or know if atheism is true or not the way we're going to be discerning what truth is is to study the word of God so be careful because many are going to be deluded in the last days 2 Timothy chapter 3 2 Timothy uh, chapter 3 verse 1 to 15 says this know also that in the last days perilous times will come for men will be lovers of their own selves covetous, boasters, proud, blasphemers disobedient to parents unthankful, unholy without natural affliction truce bakers, false accusers incontinent, fierce despisers of those that are good Traitors, heady, high-minded, lovers of pleasure more than lovers of God, having a form of godliness but denying the power thereof, from such turn away. For this sort are they which creep into houses and lead captive silly women laden with sins, led away with divers lust, ever learning and never able to come to the knowledge of the truth. Now as jamborees and jamborees with us stood Moses, so do these also resist the truth. Men of corrupt minds sorry reprobate concerning the faith but they shall proceed no further for their folly shall be manifest unto all as theirs also but thou hast fully known my doctrine manner of life purpose faith long suffering charity patience persecutions and afflictions which came unto Antioch Iconium and Listeria what persecutions I endured but out of them all the Lord delivered me ye and all that will live godly in Christ Jesus shall suffer persecution. But evil men and seducers shall wax worse and worse, deceiving and being deceived. And from as, and that from a child thou hast known the holy scriptures, which are able to make thee wise unto salvation through faith which is in Christ Jesus. So there's going to be a darkness in the land and in the nations. People are going to turn away from the word of God and you need to get into the word of God to be discerning so you can discern who's telling the truth and who's telling the lie.